choose, especially Death. the second time around, brother. There's something you don't do when you mess with the king, and that is making him a liar. I'm not a liar. I'm a lot of things. I said that. I'm a lot of things. <laughs> I've gone to full lengths to piss people off. I even posed as an interviewer and beat the crap out of a wrestler in front of his family. I don't care what I have to do. I am winning at Snow Brawl March 23rd. And you're convinced, that you're convinced that as a fan, you're convinced that, that you can do this, that, that this can happen for you. Knowing the beating that you took the last time. My eye and my jaw are my scars that I will wear with pride as I bloody necro butcher in front of all you freaking people. <laughs> all you peasants, all you filth, you make me sick to be a wrestler. Well, Junior Reyes, sounds like you've been losing some matches lately. Sounds like you haven't won one in a while. Sounds like you haven't been laid in a while. you grow some hair, you can talk to me. Till then, sit your ass in the corner and watch a pro at work. Hey, man, it looks like you had one too many cheeseburgers in paradise. So let me tell you something right now. Let me tell you something right now. If there is anything left of your scarred up, disgusting, beaten carcass after the necro butcher torches you again on March 23rd, I will pick it up and throw it over the top rope at Snowball, eliminating your dumb ass. Go get another listen, cheeseburger. Listen, unlike some people in this room, I actually have a real match. And I don't care if it's for my career. It doesn't matter if it's for my career, because I know I'm going to win. It's as simple as that. Now, if uh, I were to enter Snowball, best be known, you're looking at the real winner. Now, Reyes, are you actually going to do this match by yourself, or are you going to have Trigger in your corner again? <laughs> Trigger does what Trigger does. He likes to think he's the best because he's the best. And quite honestly, sometimes I have migraines and aneurysms sitting in the same room with Trigger. But Trigger is part of my little stable. What's left of the Bronx Bombers, even though, unfortunately, he's not from the Bronx. There's, like, really nobody left in your stable, but okay. But you said you got to go in that rumble after you get done getting your ass kicked by uh, Necro? Again. Again, for the second time. And again. And real bloodied. But, uh, let me do, I got news for you. If Bobby Jr. doesn't get his hands on you, Octane will. We got a whole lot of piss and vinegar in this room right now. I hate to say this. It's like a pile of mishmash. Octane, man. you seem to have beef with a lot of people, man. I mean, you, don't, you have a death wish that everybody's going to get you all at once. Like, what's wrong with you? Octane don't care how many there are, how big you are, because Octane's going full throttle. I have just one, actually one question. This question has been plaguing me for so long. And it's like actually probably the only thing I really wanted to ask coming down here. Finny, hey. being a brilliant, brilliant businessman, why do you surround yourself with such freaking morons? Why do you call... <laughs> you said it. You put nail, hit the nail Morons? You bounce a check every damn time to them. That's why. You got Octane. You got oh, oh. beautiful Octane. Bobby Drew. No, 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 no. We fired Octane. Octane <laughs> Was he around? One time only deal. One time only. Because I found a better bodyguard now, so, you know, it's... Either way, cuts his chase. Oh, come on, baby. Right you surround yourself with on. morons, all right. and all these morons have yet to win titles. And the only manager that actually got anyone anything is Nicoletta. Just a second. Haven't haven't you ever heard like of I Kevin? I said, no winners, no titles, and just a second. no nothing. Just a second. Haven't you ever heard of Kevin Nash? Kevin Nash has said time and time again, this business is not measured upon championships. It's measured upon dollars earned, brother. And I make more money than you. 
Last time I checked, I was higher on the card, and I get paid more than you could possibly imagine. It's all about, it's it's all about the Benjamins. There's a reason I'm the king. It's all about the Benjamins. You see, I don't care about titles. I care about matches won and money earned. Grace, That's all I care about. For Vinny, it's all about family dollar shopping sprees. And my last question is simple. When the hell can I get out of here? When is my contract say I have to be here for this long? Sir, I could arrange for you to leave right now because my guys are going to take you out if you don't shut your mouth. Listen, I have a full-length chain in my car right now, ready to use. And I'm, honestly, your uh, my eyes are set on you, Vinny. You know, don't th think I... <laughs> Vinny, Don't think I won't Vinny, do it. I gotta agree with you on something. Let's get rid of this guy. Let's all of us just team up right now and kick the shit out of this guy right now. Mr. Reyes, your your contractual obligations have been fulfilled. And uh, if whenever you feel it necessary, sir, you may you may go. Thank you. And Mr. Jerry Warner, I don't care how much you order me around. The king does the ki what the king does. Yeah, you see that? My limo dropped kick. I you got the King, will yeah. not die. I am not a liar. You ain't mad, Hardy. I'm. You ain't mad, Hardy. Don't say that. Oh, don't I'm in a room with a bunch Hardy, of marks. It doesn't guy. matter. He ain't mad, Hardy. He's the Burger King for crying out loud. He's the King. Who's he he is? Can I get a Whopper and cheese to go, please? The only King you are, brother, is the King <laughs> of the toilet bowl. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. He's the Burger King. <laughs> All right, all right, listen, 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 you guys, you guys were invited here. This Best man known. Was, this man was forced to come Everybody here. Everybody is a target. The war is still waged. I have gone nowhere. The fear is still here. Let me be the first to say, I put my money on Necro Butcher to kick your ass. <laughs> and with that. 100 that says Necro wins. And, and with that, we thank Junior Reyes for being yeah, here. Definitely, man. And we wish him a safe drive home. Yep, and, uh, good luck on his match. <laughs> good luck. Yeah, yeah, seriously. Big time, man. But, uh, hey. I think maybe we should turn around and hit a commercial or something like that. After these messages, we'll be back.
Back. What's going on? Beautiful oh, F5 yeah, music. Definitely. Beautiful. F5, check them out if you see them. Okay. I would love to see F5 at a live show, to be completely honest. They're Beautiful Bobby strong. Dream would pay for a ticket to see him. Now, I would like I would just like to say thank you to Tom Coe for having me again on the Healing Face live wrestling show, the commissioner of ECPW Long Island. Thank you very much, sir. I appreciate Not a problem, it. My friend. Not a problem. Next week, if you'd like to have me back, I'd be more than happy to be here. Is me forgetting somebody? Oh, man. Thank you, too, Sean. <laughs> Sean, thank you for having yeah. me, too. I appreciate you having me down here, you mark. But anyway, next week, if you guys would like to have me down here, I'd appreciate it. I really would. And if, you, and if you'd have me, I can promise to have a special guest with me. Someone who's been trained by a Hall of Famer. That's all I'm going to say. Uh, well, come on. you got to give us a little bit of something, man. That's all I can say. Next week, I've got a big surprise for all of you. Right. I'm beautiful Bobby Dream. Bold is beautiful. Sweet dreams. Thanks for having me. All right. Check you later, Bobby, man. Wow. All right. You heard it. You heard uh, it apparently, he, yeah. apparently he's Definitely. got a special surprise that he, he wants to bring along with him. So, Sean, who's on next week? Well, Besides Bobby. I, I, guess, I guess we'll see. We'll hear from Bobby next week. But we have a special request. Play it for me. Go ahead, man. What is Octane it? Octane will be here next week. Y'all better listen in. Oh shit! We I, I have think another day, I, another well, week like I, that. I think, I think <laughs> that's it. That's that's just it. I think. <laughs> you know what? I think we had a good uh, show tonight, and we thank everybody that was in the house. Octane, beautiful Bobby Dream, Vinny the Guido, hey, Papa Ganoush, and also the none other than the King, Junior Reyes. Yes, Check them th- out. Th- thanks for com- thanks for uh, thanks to Junior Reyes for being here, even though you were forced. I mean, uh, yeah, definitely, man. I'm, I'm sure wherever you are. I'm sure I'd like to have you here less angry next time. Yeah, maybe on <laughs> better terms of not being forced. Definitely. Right, maybe you come on your own free will. All right, but uh, we appreciate everybody, and uh, we'll check you out. So thanks, Jerry Werner, for calling you know, in. Yeah, Jerry. Thanks Boondocks. to Boondocks for calling yeah. in. Thanks to Octane and beautiful Bobby Dream and. The insurance policy, Papa Ganoush, and thanks, Boldy Smurf, for showing up. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Go run out, run outside with your feather and make it, and uh, and go home. All right. And uh, I guess there's the limo driver we gotta thank. We thank everybody, and yeah. uh, we'll see you next. Yeah, week. for uh, for for the heel whose autograph is worth. For the heel who's got a lot of fans, that's me. For Tommy C, the face, whose autograph yeah. is still worth three cents on eBay. Hey, man, and for the hall monitor, choices, we're checking out. We'll see you next week. All right. Ciao, later.